Welcome to my first instalment of studying Proverbs. So in this video series, we're going to be going through the book of Proverbs in the Bible, more specifically the New American Standard Version, which my father recently brought for me, uh, which is really kind of him, very nice Bible. Thanks, Dad. OK, so I want to start off with Proverbs chapter 1, verse 1 and verse 2. There's no point in me just doing a video on verse 1, because all it literally says is the Proverbs of Solomon, the son of David, king of Israel. And we can't really discuss much about that. It's fairly just straightforward. So the second verse says, to know wisdom and instruction. So the book, it says the premise of the book is to understand wisdom and instruction from people. Without wisdom, without knowing instruction in life, you are deceived into taking the wrong turn. In other words, there's lots of things from society, from the media that bombard us, and they're not always wise. In fact, most of them probably aren't wise. They're not wisdom. Wisdom comes from within. It comes from, from my concern, from knowing Jesus, reading the Bible. Wisdom is very important. There is something called worldly wisdom, which, although doesn't come from God, isn't necessarily always bad. OK, some worldly wisdom is about etiquette and how you uh, go forth socially and so on and so forth. And all that can be quite good. That does come under to wisdom. Instruction is how you live your life. Now, instruction these days is poo hoo. The younger generation, even millennials like myself, don't want to listen to instruction because instruction offends us. It annoys us. It causes us to become very offended, yes, by what people have to say. We want to live life in the way we think is right. We don't want to, to heed the instruction of an older person, of somebody more in the know, somebody who can instruct us about life. We think we're right. We think we've got it right. And this sort of attitude is what Proverbs is speaking against as a whole book. It speaks against gaining wisdom and gaining instruction wisdom on how to live your life, how to choose the right partner for marriage. These, All these things are very, very, very important. OK, that is my first commentary on Proverbs chapter 1, verses 1 and 2. Please do stay tuned for verse two, uh, 3, please. And please hit that bell icon, subscribe to me, like the videos, because I want to build up a following on, on this channel and hopefully get messages out to other people. Thanks very much for watching.